Hey, it's Lorena with FamilyVacationGoals.com, and I'm coming to you to share a little bit about the Virgin Voyages. So that's a brand new ship, a brand new ship that is going to be selling out of Miami. They also are going to sell out of Europe, um, and it is called the Scarlet Lady. So last time I was at let's see, one of our ports that we were at on the Disney cruise, we looked over onto the Virgin Cruise, onto the Scarlet Lady, and I got to tell you, it's rare that when I'm on a Disney cruise, I'm jealous of people on other cruise ships. This cruise ship looked posh, amazing. So I had to take the training and I did. And I'm super excited about sharing this with you guys. It's an adults only cruise ship. Um, they are sustainable and have a lot of really great practices that are good for the environment, good for the earth and good for the people on the earth. So very much my jam. Um, they also have some amazing, unique couture boutique spaces and some dynamo food options. So we're gonna go through, and this is just gonna be a peep at the ship. We're gonna go through each of the decks and I'm gonna show you some of the videos about the different restaurants and the different things there are to do on site, on, not on site, on ship, on board. Um, so let's start with deck five. I think I'll start in the back of the ship and work my way forward. So pink agave, people who love themselves some margaritas can rejoice. Pink Agave is elevated Mexican fare designed by Tom Dixon with a menu that is acclaimed Mexican chef, Sylvania Salacio Espraza. Um, this restaurant was inspired by Mexico City's vibrant food scene, an immersive odyssey of Mexican cuisine. The beverage program celebrates the tradition of distilling tequila and mezcal as a master of ceremonies guides sailors to a highly curated and intimate dining experience. One of the things I love about Virgin Voyages is that they've gotten rid of buffets. Like I love me the opportunity to try a bunch of little things, but oftentimes the quality of the food on a traditional cruise ship is not as great as those uh, and those more curated options where they're ready to order, they're made to order restaurants. Um, and that's exactly what Pink Agave offers in every restaurant on board. So let's return. Check out next Razzle Dazzle. So this is a funky kind of retro feel. Uh, Razzle Dazzle is located in deck five. It's vegetarian forward fare. So with Virgin, there's really something for everyone's taste buds and interests. Designed by Concrete Amsterdam, this space boasts bold interiors and offers surprising twists and some classic comfort to goes. Home of the ship's, ship's drag brunch, which is so fun. There's a drag brunch on board. That's my jam. Uh, the vegetarian forward menu is where the purest of bites intersect with tastefully sinful flavors. Go light and healthy or order the most amazing taste of bad ever. Yum. So super fun interiors here. The Redemption Wellness Spa. This is a really cool spa um, designed by HKS. Our onboard spa is the ultimate form of self-care to our sailors. From massages so good they'll make you question life itself to a mudroom. I've never tried a mudroom, so I'm all about that. Uh, will revitalize your soul and body. It's also complete with a hydrotherapy pool, salt room. Salt rooms are supposed to be really good for your body, face, skin, all that jazz your soul. <laughs> and I've never tried a salt room before either. Cold plunge pools, quartz beds, and rejuvenated spa treatments. By night, sailors can attend a virgin twist on the traditional sauna-based off-glass purification and entertainment rituals, DJ included. So they turn the spa into a DJ situation. So since it's virgin cruises, there's a lot of music and vibration and energy that's been incorporated into the entire ship even their spa. It's not your normal humdrum spa. The sailor services, that's just your basic there to help. Nothing too exciting about that, except for that they'll help you. <laughs> All right, let's go onward. Next deck, we're gonna look at deck six. So there's a lot of different restaurants on ship, on board, about 20 restaurants. Extra Virgin is their Italian location. Extra virgin on deck six, that's going to be elevated Italian eatery. Rooted in Italian culinary traditions, this trattoria serves regionally inspired food and fresh handmade pasta. Designed in collaboration between HKS and Volume London, this restaurant starts with an antipasta followed by a pasta-centric favorite for three. Yes, ma'am. Yes, thank you, please. And is topped off with a traditional aperitif. 
to I do not know how to see some of these words. I apologize <laughs> to make the night complete or help get it started. See, it's so fun and bougie. I just don't even know. All right. Test kitchen. So oh, I think I, let me, I think I missed one though, because I'm trying to go from the back to the front. The wake. We'll get to test kitchen in a second. The Wake on Deck 6 is steak and seafood, the perfect mix of sophistication, nostalgia, and cool you'll find entering the Wake as an event in and of itself. With a menu designed by the acclaimed Chef Brad Fermari, the regal, glamorous, and steak and seafood focused menu makes the most elevated restaurants on the ship without ever feeling stuffy. So a lot of really gorgeous interiors. And that's why I really wanted to share this because I think it's so unique to get a get a summary of what the restaurants are like, get some pictures of the ambiance, and then also the food. So this is a really cool tutorial. Test Kitchen, we'll come back to here. This looks so much fun. So Test Kitchen on deck six is a cooking lab and restaurant inspired by Oscoffier's mock cuisine. This laboratory-like eatery is part of cooking school and part restaurant. So really unique, fun date night option. Designed by Concrete Amsterdam and with a menu led by Chef Matt Lambert and beverage program designed by Julie Mamos, it's educational, experiential, and social. With classes and evolving taste menus, this is for the curious boundary pushing taste buds on board. So you can see they've got a lot of unique ideas, unique options. Um, I looked at the menu for this restaurant. It looks next level. So I'm definitely gonna wanna check this out. High Street. So this is a... a Culmination of different uh, shop options. High Street on deck six, retail therapy. Designed by Soft Room, this is a bold and refreshingly different curated collection of items at sea, set to provide the perfect shop entertainment for sailors who love to indulge in retail therapy. Shops with the interiors by Volume London include everything from the Virgin brand shops to finer costumes or jewelry. Fine or costume jewelry, <laughs> men and women's apparel, leather goods and watches, plus our duty-free, aptly named, booty-free shop. Fit in some care, self-care time at Dry Dock, our blow dry bar, stubble and groom or onboard barbershop, or even squid ink, our own tattoo parlor shop. So if you have had a little too much, you've been a little too overserved, you can make bad choices at squid ink and take them home with you. <laughs> Not everything that happens on Virgin Cruise Line stays on Virgin Cruise Line if you stop by the Squid Ink. All right, on the rocks. Mixology focused. This mixology focused bar is located at the heart of the roundabout. It's the to-go spot for sailors who are serious about their specialty, specialty cocktails, all crafted by global bartending champion and former beverage director of the aviary in Chicago, Charles Jolie. Lots of fun spaces to share time with your significant other or couples. Um, the Scarlet Lady looks like an amazing opportunity for multiple different times of travel. Girls vacations, um, couple vacations, family reunions where it's only adults, and just romantic vacations as well. The Manor, this is the nightclub. Alluring nightclub, the two-story Roman and Williams designed three bar space named after Richard's first recording studio is inspired by a classical theatrical z -gist, layered with a moody and sexy 70s punk vibe. Groundbreaking shows include cocktail hour where the hostess will kick off the night before it transitions to a mind-blowing nightclub. So the, a, lot of, um, a lot of ships and sailings kind of leave something to be desired when it comes to the nightlife, but that is not the case with Virgin Voyages. They've got lots of opportunities and options for people with different tastes. The casino. The casino is smoke-free. The casino is smoke-free, which means I can go and spend my money and probably make exactly what I paid um, for that sailing back because uh, the house doesn't always win. Sometimes mama wins. Anyway, so the casino is located on deck six and it's more than just your typical casino. The HKS designed retro cool space reminiscent of the 1960s Las Vegas is where you come to ante up while sipping on a shaken extra dry martini. Keep your hot streak going strong at the tables with a straight flush of games and act activations, activations like a James Bond night. Oh, that's fun, a James Bond night. I hadn't read about that before. The Den. The Den's on deck six. This is an event space and it's an exclusive space bookable for private events, group trainings, gatherings, or any collective happenings our sailors choose to organize with their people. 
So if you're going with a lot of work folks or you're doing a reunion or just a group event, this is the place to check out. The Red Room Theater. Live performance space designed by architects Work AC, our larger than life entertainment space is the first ever transformational multi-form theater at sea. Boundary pushing performances on the traditional proscenium stage or late night dance parties on the flat floor, con floor configuration, undiscovered experiences are always unfolding here. Designed in partnership with the renowned theater design consultants, Arbach Pollock Freelander, we've created a unique and flexible while still being intimate, theater space that delivers a sea of possibilities. So it's not gonna be your standard magician, um, like you get on other voyages. Magician, singer, while those are all good and fun, this is next level entertainment and it's unique boutique experience. So that is deck six, let's meander on. Deck seven. So obviously we're not gonna go through all the decks because many of the decks have just got state rooms, but the state rooms are gorgeous and I will do another video about that. I just wanted to give everyone a feel for all the unique spaces on the ship. The dock. Mez Lounge with ocean views and Mez style bits. The dock, also designed by Roman and Williams, combines elegant seaside chilling with the chic vacation vibes of the Mediterranean in the heat of summer. Sip refreshing beverages designed by the beverage expert at Bar Lab while indulging in a wide variety of recipes designed by acclaimed chef Brad Femier. So food, drinks, and sun. I don't think you can get any better than that. And as they pull back, you'll be able to see, I think they show some of the Lux accommodations for seating of like this very nice posh bed that you can sleep on and enjoy. Um, that's a great place for sunning and tanning and relaxing, reading a book. These are my kind of accommodations. They're just gorgeous. The Dock House. Deck seven has casual Mediterranean designed by Roman and Williams. This effortlessly elegant lounge boasts bright flavors that are anything but laid back. Live acoustic sounds round out each taste. Select from choice cuts and a fresh fish for the tableside open flame or bites like house-made pita and dips from the roving mezzi cart. Very unique options. The social club. Peer inspired classics. Designed by Roman and Williams and inspired by traditional British peers, this space offers a taste of nostalgia in a fun and lighthearted carnival inspired environment, including the version of South, a version of a soda fountain bar, diner, and nautical bar. Here, the food and drink make the experience with modern takes on fairground classics. Super fun. The Loose Cannon Bar, a nautically themed bar, also part of the social club, the Loose Cannon's opening gun salutes, salute signals Bureau Clock and the Scarlet Lady. The space was designed by renowned architects Roman and Williams. This bar serves as the ship's seaside watering hole with colorful characters and nautical beverages, with witty bartenders, plentiful pitchers of beer, storytelling and playful trivia nights, sailors are sure to revel in this entertainment. Brown's coffee, who doesn't love their coffee? I love thoughtfully sourced coffee. Exclusively pouring one of the most satisfying and tasting brews we've ever had from direct trade pioneers, Intelligista Coffee, Grounds Club, is like your favorite coffee shop with the best almond milk, double shot latte you've ever had, but with ocean views. This space is also designed by Soft Room. Can't cruise without a little bit of coffee. I mean, and pizza. Pizza is cruise worthy. You're always going to get to that evening and just crave some pizza bites. This is a fast, casual version of your favorite slice joint, but with an infinitely more opportunities. Design your own bespoke pizza or order from our curated menu of delicious pizzas made from local dough provided by the farmer Mr. O1 Pizza Makers based in Wyndham, Wynwood, Miami. Can't go wrong with pizza. The chart room on deck five. Shore Things, this is a central place to meet the Shore Things team and discover all the things that there are to do when sailors set foot on land. So this is gonna be your excursions location. This is also the place where you can always find some of our sailor crew services ready to assist you. So you, typically guests will book in advance their shore excursions, but there is the option to go and chat with people when you're on board. The draft house. 
Local tap room with curated drafts, the selective beer drinkers go to. Draft House is designed by Soft Room to be a relaxed meeting spot featured, featuring eight seasonal on tap varieties, plus a wide range of artisanal bottles. We've taken it to local and partnered with Miami's own Windward Brewing Company to create a signature craft beer, an English pale ale with a hint of red. This airy beach bar meets stylish craft beer house, provides plenty of spaces to sit back and sip, or just grab a growler for those bring your brew with you kind of days. The roundabout. Let us guide you. When sailors first step on board, they encounter our thoughtfully sourced coffee shop, ground cl Grounds Club here, as well as our chart room, the home base for Shore Things info. Get lost, where you book your next Virgin Voyage, Virgin Vinyl, our onboard record shop, Lick Me Till the Ice Cream, a vintage style scoop shop, also included in your voyage fare, and Draft House, our beer lover's haven, and our essential shops. A whole bunch of ice cream that's included. So, I mean, the kid, your kid at heart will enjoy that. Groupie, I love private karaoke. <laughs> Designed by Roman Coppola, Coppola, the groupie was created as a modernist take on Japanese style karaoke rooms with sailors to enjoy singing along to their favorite tunes with friends. With song choices that span decades, genres, and I gotta close this. I'm gonna, apparently my battery is gonna die. With song choices that span decades, genres and octave abilities, these bookable free private sessions require having your go-to tracks chosen, your singing voice warm and invited friends ready for a private dancing and song battle to remember. Let me get this plugged in. Hopefully there's an outlet over here. I may have to change locations. Okay. We're just gonna change the side I'm sitting on so I can plug in. Okay. That's how we roll. We just pivot when we need to pivot. All right, return. Sip, food and bar. On deck seven, you're gonna run into the champagne lounge. Okay, so one of the coolest things that I saw, I mean, the whole ship is amazing, but with when you use the version app, you can shake for champagne, which means if you shake your phone and the app, when you have the app open, you can confirm that you want champagne brought to you wherever you are and they find you and bring you champagne. But if you don't want them to bring you champagne, you can go to champagne at the champagne lounge. Our curated champagne lounge crafted in collaboration with lifelong food and beverage professional, Charles Jolie was designed to satisfy many needs, no matter the time of day. Craving a posh early breakfast, high tea in the afternoon, or caviar with an effervescent nightcap in the evening. Whatever the time, you can be sure bubbly will be on the menu all day in this glamorous lounge for sailors in need of sparkly refresher. All right, so that completes deck seven. There's a lot to see. Thanks for sticking in here with me. Oh, I must have missed one. Do, 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 do the arcade. I missed the arcade because there's no green arrow. The arcade. These are all included. So any guys that are, I don't know, 40 something, 30 something, 40 something are going to really enjoy these arcade games that are included. That high score is calling your name. Located in the social club, the arcade is packed full of nostalgic video games and other immersive childlike fun that stems from a time in life when you had less candles to blow out on your birthday cake. Get your game on and play all you want on us. Yes, it's free. These games include Pac-Man, Daytona Twin Sit Down, Two Seats, Golden Tea, Mario Brothers, Defender, Stargate, Afterburner, Sunset Riders, Golden Age, Donkey Kong, Millipede, Mortal Kombat, and Space Invaders. Impress your lady by getting a high score. <laughs> All right, back to the menu. Now we should, oh, did I miss another one? I guess we didn't look at the Lick Me Till Ice Cream. Okay, we'll go click on that one. I'm like failing here. Where is, oh, it's way down here. Oh, cause we gotta go to both of these, okay. Voyage Vinyl, the record store. Music is our DNA. Get lost in the music while you get not so lost at sea. With our brand history rooted deeply in music, our sonic identity perk peaks at the record shop on board. Stacked with music, magazines, headphones, and record players, you can also pull up a listening station from a stack from our selection of both classic and current albums, including special and limited editions. And then the Lick Me Till ice cream. So this is also included too. The Whimsical Ice Cream Shop offers 
home or ship made complimentary scoops. That includes six creative artis artisanal flavors guaranteed to satisfy every sweet tooth craving. I know I clicked on all these. Let's see which one I did. did, 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 did. I hit all these. I've got all the green arrows. Green, 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 green. Okay, we're just going to move forward. Deck 14. So it does show you some of the different room types. The cheeky corner suite on deck 14 is category SC. Was it SCB? Wrapping panoramic views from the corner of the ship are emphasized by the exquisite design choices in the suite. Sailors will enjoy custom interior wicker chairs to the highest and biggest of the cheeky corner terraces, meant to maximize sea views. So it's approximately 615 to 857 square feet for each stateroom. The suite aft suite, category SAB. The sweetest life at sea, with endless views from the back of the ship, whether you're relaxing at the Terra Champagne table or gazing at the waves directly from your indoor peekaboo shower window, there's no such thing as a bad view of this suite. So sizing is between 416 and 661 square feet. The Sea Terra, so this is one of the most common um, categories on board, the sweeping ocean views. The Sea Terrace was made to create a connection with the sea, giving sailors sweeping ocean views. Add the European queen size traditional soap seabed and roomy rain showers and upgraded bathroom experience. And this space has everything a sailor might need. The Brilliant Suite, taking sailing to a new level. Inner rockers will come alive in the suite with a view onto the European king bed and beyond from the indoor peekaboo shower. Just brilliant. Average square footage is 482. So that are all the, those are all the ones on deck 14. Let's head to deck 15, only a couple more decks to go, but trust me, it's worth staying to learn more about this amazing ship. Gun Bay. Social and hands-on dining experience. Hands-on meat grilling, soju drinking, and maximum social engagement is the focus of this Korean barbecue led by Chef Suhi Kim. The dining experience is interactive, engaging, and always entertaining, using food and drink as a catalyst to bring sailors together. Designed by Soft Room London. I've, oh, I think this is such a fun concept. You know, the majority of all-inclusive resorts or even ships have got a, maybe a Japanese style restaurant, um, but very few, if any, have got a Korean barbecue included uh, as an option. So that's a really fun, unique option. The galley, a little something for everyone. Modeled after popular food halls, the galley features individual vendors, each with a unique concept, including a bakery and pastry shop, a panini shop, a burger grill, a taco shack, and a sushi bar with bento boxes. Yes, please. A noodle bar, a soup and salad stand, and a 24-hour American diner designed by Soft Room London. Oh, I, we have gotten so into, with the cold weather, um, these noodle experiences. So tasty. I love me some high-end ramen. So there's a lot of food on here and you may want to try to get in a workout here or there, but the workouts are kind of unique and fun and all group classes are included with your cruise fair. So you can do any of the group classes you want, uh, cycling, boxing, yoga. There's a ton of different class options that are included with your cruise fair on board. More coffee because coffee. Galley Grounds is exclusively pouring one of the most satisfying and tasty brews we've ever had. The Ground Club 2 is an extension of the other onboard coffee shops, Ground Club, Grounds Club. Both will feature coffee from the direct trade pioneers, Intelligista Coffee, designed by Softroom. Burn and Bike, Deck 15. This is the bike and burn side of B Complex, designated for cycle and cardio workouts, and all group fitness classes are on us. Aquatic Club. Poolside cocktails. Get all of your signature by the pool cocktails, including frozen margaritas, pina coladas, 
Getting caught in the rain, daiquiris, and the ship's signature Mai Tai on tap. Sailors can escape the sun and grab a seat or order a shake for champagne. Like I mentioned, shake the app for champagne. They bring it to you. Service to have their champagne brought directly to them. Lots of fun energy on the ship. Gym and tonic. After working up a sweat or standing around thinking about maybe possibly working up a sweat, that's more me. Uh, restore yourself by hopping in our well-being pool. Boost your performance or your performance of a performance with a fresh cold pressed juice served at the gym and tonic bar. And then there's My Beast, an artistic adult playground and fitness apparatus designed by Equilibria, which will add a Venice beach-like atmosphere to the area. Tune up with wellness. This is Manny, Petty, and Mad Medi. Oh my. Many petty services meet many spa treatments at this enhanced nail salon, sweeping views of the ocean. There's no pedicure like a pedicure with an ocean view. The gorgeous suites, so we're gonna get back to the cabins. These suites are just real worthy. Name worthy of our sailors. A name worthy of our sailors. Relaxing is truly an art form in the suites, terrace hammock swing chair. The perfect spot to enjoy a nightcap while watching the moon flirt with the sea. Our suite includes our mega rock star benefits, Richard's rooftop access, early booking, priority access, premium Wi-Fi, bottomless in-room bar, daily tabs, daily spa access, private transfers, and dedicated rock star agent coming in at seven, 570 square feet. Fab suite. Rockstar dreams are made of this. The second biggest suite on the ship is perfect for those who love to host with amazing views and space to live out rockstar rolling dreams galore. This suite includes the mega rockstar benefits that we already mentioned and is about 950 square feet. So a very large option. This scene, this is another bookable space designed by Tom Dixon. The exclusive space is for private events and groups. The flexible room features adjustable furniture and digital screen, backlit adjustable lighting and floor to ceiling windows for stunning views. And then the massive suite, I mean, they're not gonna mince words on this. The suite has, this suite needs no introduction. The most extra of the mega rockstar quarters this one truly lives up to the name. When not in your music room, that doubles as a second bedroom, you can watch the waves from your terrace hot tub, lose yourself in the music, and find yourself again the next morning meditating alongside the waves on your sprawling personal terrace. This includes all the mega rock star benefits and is 2,147 square feet of bliss. All right, so we'll go back here. Let's check out deck 16, only two more decks to go. The net. This looks super fun. You can go and just laze and enjoy. Outside the athletic club, our catamaran net is suspended 16 decks up, allowing you to re relax in peak sailor style, soak up the sun during your day, or head up at night for breathtaking views of the stars. It's a really unique idea. The athletic club. Oh my God, this looks like so much fun. I mean, who doesn't want to go box by the ocean? Designed by Concrete Amsterdam, this place offers the perfect complement to your pre-post or even mid-workout hydration needs. So this can maintain their endorphin high by grabbing an ice cold ginger shot, beer, or a low ABV cocktail to accompany a round of deck games. And look at all these fun swings that they have out there too. A little bit adult, a little bit of kid. It's gonna hit all those different needs. I know my kids always enjoy the basketball and so does my husband. We go on ships. The cabanas. So you can rent private cabanas, escape with your own private hideaway in one of our grand cabanas overlooking the serene waves. These extra large cabanas are bookable for the entire day, include a drink package of your choosing and can hold up to four sailors comfortably. So it's a fun little upgrade. Sun Club Cafe. Deck 16, fresh juice, cold taps. An outdoor cafe in the Sun Club where a perfect complement to your food is delicious and refreshing drink while you wait, including poke bowls, ice cold draft beer, or from the tap, or a freshly made juice. The tequila kick if you're up for it. I'm always up for it. Sun Club, here's a little bit more. For Sun Worship, this deck is for those who love the perfect glowed views, sun glowed views, complemented with refreshing bites and drinks. And then Richard's Lounge, an exclusive outdoor VIP lounge. So this is for those certain suite types. 
This Tom Dixon exclusive design exclusive lounge is the place to see and be seen for mega rock star and rock star quarters. Sailors. Laid back drinks are inspired by Roger, Richard Branson's lifestyle, including a selection of frozen drinks and wine from Richard's own vineyard. So you can only get access for these to these if you're staying in those rock star quarters. And then the last two options. The perch in active wellness. This looks so there's, I think there are a few things more delicious than well, the food that I'm seeing on here, but also yoga by the ocean it is my favorite. Um, outdoor yoga deck having here on our upper level deck, this yoga meditation and stretch based space is where our group fitness classes start as we salute the sun. Another part of the concrete Amsterdam designed athletics club, the perch is a peaceful place for the day to begin for sailors as they complete their As asanas, as asanas. Why well, can't I say that? I know that word, asanas, <laughs> overlooking the ocean while breathing in the salty air. The runway, there's always a track on every ship, and the Virgin uh, Scarlet Lady is no exception. The outdoor track is a 250 meter long elevated signature Virgin Red running track that forms a halo like version vision over the ship. Perfect for sailors who want to sweat, strut, or skate while breathing in the salty air and filling the sea mist. Breathe it out, run it out, approximately six laps equals a mile. So there's no excuse to abandon your marathon training schedule. So those are the lady ships. Um, I do plan to try to put together a group sailing, which is called a circle um, in the near future. And I'm happy to answer any questions you might have about the ship. There's so much involved in this ship. Um, amazing food, amazing spaces, a great price, in my opinion, for everything you're getting. And they're very like, you get what you get. It, there's no hidden costs. They've done a great job. You don't pay any gratuities that's included in your cruise fare. Their beverage program is uh, where you can purchase and get an extra bonus right now and 20% off. So if you purchase a $300 bar tab, you get an extra $100 right now. Um, and you're all, they're also offering 20% off of voyage fares. So feel free to send me a message, familyvacationgoals.com for more info. Thanks so much for watching.